Hey yo, what's good, y'all? SOS Wrestle Talk back at y'all once again for another New Japan Pro Wrestling Best of the Super Junior 31 updated standings recap. So we are gonna kind of give y'all what's where we're at with the far as the standings with Best of the Super Junior. What matches we're gonna have tomorrow? Maybe the rest of the weekend, so on and so forth. If this is your first time checking us out, I am the Pro Wrestle Fly God. I am Star Shiaku. I am Blunt to Unido, the Human Ally J Cap. And please don't be afraid to hit that like or subscribe button, man. It don't cost you anything. The price of subscription, let me tell you, let you in on a little secret, is free 99. Like I said, it won't cost you a penny. So, best of the Super Junior updated standings right now. After, I want to say three days of action because we've had the first day to had two th to, uh, both the blocks happen. Then we had kind of alternating days as far as the blocks go. So block A, here are our updated standings for the block. So leading block A right now, we have Teton with a record of 3-0, totaling six points. Blake Christensen representing GCW with a record of 3-0, totaling six points. We have the Intergalactic Jet Setter himself, Kevin Knight, with a record of 2-1, totaling four points. The former multi-time IWGP Junior Heavyweight Champion, El Desperado, former BSOJ winner, with a record of 2-1, totaling four points. Clark Connors, 100 proof. My Dog For Real with a record of 2-1, equaling four points as well. Hayata with a record of one and two equaling two points. Kose Fujita, same one and two, two points. Yoshinobu Kanemaru, the, the, the heel master himself with a record of one and two, totaling two points. Then we have Bushi and TJP with a record of 0 oh and three, totaling zero points right now. These boys have zero points. They sit on a big fat goose egg. So moving on to block B action, we have Kushida and Taiji Shimori elite in the block with a record of 3-0, totaling four points. We have Show with a record of 2-1, equaling four points. Same with Ninja Mac, 2-1, four points. Francisco Akira with a record of 1-2, totaling two points. Same with Robbie Eagles, 1-2, totaling two points. Hiromu Takahashi, Doki, Drillin' Maloney, not to be outdone. These guys are all tied with a similar record of 1 and 2, totaling 2 points. And Dragon Dia sitting on that fat goose egg with a record of 0 and 3, totaling 0 points as well. So we might as well talk about the matches we're going to get tomorrow night on the BSOJ Tour. The ones we're going to get, I, I think we're going to have a, some action Sunday, and I believe Monday, so bear with me right now. So it looks like the show tomorrow, as I'm just looking up, there's another 10 match show for the best of the Super Junior, so we're going to get both the block action taking place. So without any further ado, let's take talk about the matches we're going to get tomorrow. We're getting Kose Fujita with a record of 1-2, and two, taking on Clark Connors with a record of 2-1 and run right here. So first BSOJ action of the night, block A action. If I had to pick somebody, I'm going with 100 proof Clark Connors, I think he's going to get the dub. Moving on to block B action, Dragon Dia versus Drillin' Maloney. Dragon Dia 0 and 3, Drillin' Maloney 1 and 2. Dragon Dia's got to pick up a W at some point, you would think. I don't think it's going to be in this match right here. I got Drillin' Maloney getting the victory, taking on and defeating the Dragon Gate representative right here. So moving on up the card, it's a battle of somebody's one, gots to go. Hayata with a record of 1 and 2, taking on Yoshinobu Kanemaru, same record right here. So. Both of these guys have held the junior heavyweight title for Pro Wrestling Noah a couple times, the former champions right here. I'm going to say I think Yoshinobu Kanemaru walks out the vict victor, but I would not be surprised if Hayata won this match here. So match number four on this card, we have for the Block B action, Doki taking on Ninja Mac right here. This is a first time meeting between these two guys. I'm expecting great things out of this match. I think Doki's picking up the W. I think they're starting to position Doki as one of their top key parts of the junior heavyweight division. So I think he's going to secure this victory right here and move him on ahead in this block action. So the next match right we have right here, somebody's O has to go. We have Bushi taking on TJP in block A action. Uh, they've wrestled once before. TJP got the victory when they wrestled. So somebody's O got to go. I th I'm thinking it's probably going to be TJP's, unfortunately, even though I do like TJP. Unfortunately, I think Bushi's going to keep holding on to that O just a little bit longer. So then we got Kushida with a record of 3-0, and taking on Robbie Eagles with a record of 1-2, and block B action. Eagles actually host the edge here in their the head-to-head -head matchups with a record of 1-0. and I can see Robbie Eagles getting a victory right here. You don't want to have Kushida get a hit too far ahead of the field by going 4-0, and but then that means he would have probably have to drop, like, what, four matches in a row, five matches in a row. So 
I think he's going to win. He's going to lose here. Then he's going to pick up a couple more wins. So I think that's how I foresee Kushida's BSOJ going. Then we move up right here. Teton, Blake Christian. Now somebody's O has to go in another manner because both of these guys are undefeated 3-0. and I am going to go ahead and take Teton representing LIJ here to get the victory. Although I'm not sleeping on Blake Christian right here. I, it wouldn't surprise me to see him get the dub, but I'm sticking with Teton right here to get my to, to, for my vote. Next match we have Block B action. Francisco Akira taking on Taiji Ishimori. Ishimori with a record of 3 0 right now. Francisco Akira 1 2. Ishimori holds the head to head matchup with a record of 1 0. You know what? I think we're going to have an. I think Francesca. I think Akira Francesco is getting the W. I just got that feeling in the air. I think he's going to rep the United Empire well, and I think he's going to get the W. So, then here in the penultimate match of the show, we have El Desperado taking on Kevin Knight. Both these guys with a record of 2 and 1. I got El Desperado winning. I do like Kevin Knight. He's a pretty damn good wrestler, but this is almost in the midst of El Desperado's time. So, I'm getting El Desperado. I'm giving the W right here. And for the main event of this show, we have. For the Block B main event of this night, Hiromu Takahashi sitting with a record of 1-2, taking on the IWGP Junior Heavyweight Champion Show with a record of 2-1. and one. The head-to-head -head matchup is Hiromu edges at 4-3. I say Hiromu goes up 5-3 to three here and gets the victory. So those are my predictions for tomorrow's night's best of the Super Junior matchup. Please watch the show. Watch the review that I'll have up. You know, like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff, man. Please, thank you for checking us out. We appreciate it. So... Pro Souffle, I got him signing off. Stardust Yaku, I'm up out of here. Y'all have a good rest of y'all day. Until then, peace.